All right, welcome back. We have one final segment here at the Marquette Food Co-op, and we are adding one more missing ingredient again. It seems to be the, the way that it's going this morning. So we forgot the garlic. Oh my gosh, yes, the most important ingredient. So our bulb, our clove of garlic, which our recipe calls for one clove, but I'm definitely more of at least two clove. But this I is always double up. You. This is a big clove of garlic. So you saw me just smash the garlic so I could get the skin off of it really easily. And then I nip off the root end. And then I have a fancy handy tool here to help me get the garlic. And we're just gonna go, normally I'd probably put it into that dressing jar, but we're just gonna go right into the bowl. Mm. And then take your knife, scratch off all of that. We want every bit of garlic. And now, once it's well mixed, we completed our salad. All right, we're going to let her finish mixing that, put it into the serving bowls. And while she does that, Kevin, I want to just make sure we give the proper information <laughs> for the Senior Support Series event happening on Wednesday. It's actually happening at the uh, Marquette History yep. Museum. Yep, all of them. Yes, all of them, every time. This is not a field trip situation. Nope. Um, and what exactly is this one focused on? This is focused on, in, in a part like what you've seen here, smart shopping. You know, how, how to make the most of your grocery dollars, basically, in, in a number of different, different definitions. But, you know, if you buy healthy, then you eat healthy, then you're happier. Yeah, so that's happening Wednesday at 1.30 at the History Museum. Yep, Wednesday, 1.30 uh, at, the, at the History Museum on Spring Street here in town, uh, right across from the uh, Mark Tran station. It, it's free. Um, there are door prizes that will be there. We've got uh, one... Um, uh, membership to the History Center and four $25 gift cards to the co-op here. Um, and it's, uh, we'll have some free snacks that Amanda's going to uh, have for us and uh, coffee by Dead River. Awesome. It be a fun time. Awesome. And you can, uh, we'll definitely be putting these recipes up on our website as well. Alrighty, and it's time to try the slot. But first, Sarah, I want to talk to you just a little bit. We only have a couple of minutes left about the Food as Medicine program. Yes, so the Food as Medicine program is something that people will get to learn a lot more about if they come to the Senior Support Series program that we'll be at. But this is a program where folks who are over 18, mm -hmm. at risk for, or already diagnosed with a chronic health condition and have a financial barrier to purchasing healthy food can be prescribed fresh fruits and vegetables by their doctor. And and then our partner in the program, our, our project lead, the wonderful UpCap, will send vouchers that can be spent at many area farmers markets. I think we were up to maybe 15 participating mm -hmm. farmers markets. So it's a really wonderful opportunity and the co-op helps out by assisting the farmers markets, doing the marketing, and of course, teaching more cooking classes for people enrolled in the program. So I can help people um, connect to get mm -hmm. signed up if they want. That sounds like an incredible program. And for people who are watching that want to participate in a cooking class like they saw here uh, uh, this morning, uh, where's the best place to connect and, and find out what's on your schedule? Ooh, if they want to participate in a cooking class, they can get a hold of me and my, with, they can call the co-op for my email address and we'd be happy to connect and get something started. Perfect. And of course, we will put all that information up on our website. Kevin, you've been over here awfully quiet since I handed you your bowl. I can't talk when I'm eating. This is really, really good. It really is great. I'm not a fan of cilantro, but oh, this is this is really good. I was telling you. Yeah, okay. It's great. It's great. Tio, your thoughts? It's fantastic, yeah. it's bright, it's fresh tasting. It's very good on its own, but I'm already thinking of a number of things that I would put that this on. I mean, I would put this in another salad as another crunch mm. element. I would put this mm -hmm. on top of a fish taco, or like a chicken taco, or shrimp. a burrito bowl, yeah. shrimp. Oh, the possibilities are endless, Amanda. <laughs> You're down yourself. Pretty much you can put it with anything. This was a lot of fun. I want to thank you all so much for having us here this morning and sharing your space with us. Uh, I hope you have a wonderful day. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Eat up, everybody. <laughs>